Integrated Termite Management Partnerships Between Local and Scientific Knowledge As part of a baseline study in DIGA, termites emerged as a priority issue to address land degradation and water productivity. The Nile Basin Development Challenge program is active in upstream and downstream sites in DIGA. Termites were the main constraints in the project Kabbalah. In healthy ecosystems, termites decompose organic material and enhance water infiltration. Land degradation changes termite behavior, resulting in damage to pastures, crops, and trees. Some migratory species reside in tunnels and are difficult to control. Others form mounds. Fumigation, flooding, and queen removal are not effective while chemicals are expensive with negative effects. People in Diga could not address the problem by themselves, but local practices have an important role to play when combined with scientific expertise. Consultation with community members revealed their knowledge of the area and the problem of land degradation and termites. Traditionally, people keep cattle overnight in kraals and use cow dung to enhance soil fertility. Scientists realized that adding cow dung to the soil also provides an alternative feed to termites. Based on this principle, crop residues can also be used. In addition, termite-tolerant chomograss helps to improve pastures. Scientists measure the impact of interventions on crops, termites, and soils. While farmer groups discussed and evaluated results taking into account issues as labor, costs, and gender. Results indicate that adding organic matter to the soil, combined with other interventions, reduces termite damage. Findings are being shared in farmer field days. Integrated termite management can help rehabilitate degraded rangelands, enhance agricultural production, and restore agroecosystem health in East Africa. It requires a balanced mix of biophysical and socioeconomic interventions based on local and scientific knowledge.